North Platte Kids Club had a special visitor on Thursday. Graham Eaglesham, founder and CEO of Future Kids, loves soccer. And after realizing that organizations' fees were keeping some kids off the field, he decided he wanted to change that. I, I grew up in Scotland and you know played soccer all my life, and, and I got recruited to go to Bellevue University, and I got my school paid for through a scholarship. And after I graduated, I just felt like I, I had to give something back to not just the community, but just the soccer world in general, because in Scotland, that's not a pay-to-play model. And if, if my parents in Scotland had to pay, you know, a thousand bucks a season, that I might not have been where I am today, because back home in Scotland, I, I benefited from some amazing coaches that taught me everything I know about soccer, and feel like it's, it's my duty to kind of pass that on. So that's why we started Future Kids, so that, you know, people can experience that type of coaching and hopefully take it with them without having to pay the, the, the large fee that's sometimes involved with those types of programs. Originally starting in Omaha, the club has taught kids soccer and organized matches for a few years now at no cost to anyone involved to make sure that kids have a safe and fun place to go after school. The clubs that we worked with initially would always charge quite a large fee. And we realized there was some communities in Omaha that their families couldn't afford to pay that fee to join those clubs. So Future Kids tried to combat that by, you know, sending coaches that were my buddies to begin with to, to the underserved communities and deliver the program at no cost to the kids and their families. So through a lot of um, foundation support and, and things like that and donations, we are able to pay the coaches for their time, but it doesn't cost the kids and their families the, the large fees. So that was how we started, and that just kind of grew into, you know, coming out to rural Nebraska. The program started at Cody Elementary School this week and is already active in Lexington. They hope to branch out to other schools and even offer summer camps in the future.